Hi, my name is Chris. I'm from Wickham Park Community Center, and today I'm going to teach you three easy steps how to juggle. Uh, step number one, we're going to start easy. Uh, Juggling is fun, needs concentration, and uh, can help you understand pretty much everything for any sport you play. But we're going to start with a quick and easy first step, one ball. So we start when we're going to uh, walk before we run here. So one ball, take it in your dominant hand, in my case it's the right, and all we're going to do is throw it up and over to the left, and up and back over to the right. Put it about eye at level height, and do it until you can do it about 10 times, and catch it each time. When you accomplish that, you'll stop step number one, and we can proceed on to step number two. Uh, congratulations for getting through step number one. We are back, and we are here with step number two uh, to accomplish juggling. Step number two, you're gonna get two balls. Uh, you're gonna start them both in your dominant hand. You're gonna do exactly the same thing you did with step number one, throw them about eye level, over to your other hand, and then back, and then catch it. Eye level to your left hand, back to your right, and then catch. When you accomplish that, we can try it the other way. All right, that is step two, and good luck. All right, step two is over. We are on to step three, the hardest step in juggling, but the most fun. Uh, remember, when you choose to go to step three, you want to make sure that you have three objects that are evenly weighted probably a little soft because you will be dropping them on step three. Uh, something real easy that you have at the house are just rolled up socks. Um, they're super easy to juggle and uh, soft and your mom and dad probably won't be too mad if they end up again throwing it all around the room. All right, step three, three balls. Same as step one. We're gonna throw one ball from your dominant hand where you're holding two to your other hand. And to do that, at the same time you're doing that, you're going to throw the ball from your left hand underneath that ball to this hand here. It looks something like this. All right, we'll show you one more time. All right, do that about 10 times. All right, and then you're gonna add the third one. We'll do it again. Ball up, other ball underneath. Up, underneath, and then underneath the third time. Takes a lot of practice, but when you're done, it's fun and worth the time. 